translates into House of the Serpent's Jaws, so all these doorways and stuff are actually a mouth of a serpent. There's nobody here. So if you can imagine, uh, you know, hearing a little rumor that these Mayan ruins existed and explorers went out in the 60s and, you know, thrashed through these jungles because these jungles are so thick, there's no way to just walk through them. So this used to be just covered in foliage and trees. And um, this particular ruin has two doors. The mouth of a monster is what it is. These sides that are sticking out are the noses. So this represents the mouth of their god, Itzama. This opening right here made of timber and rock represents its mouth and also its entrails and this is how you enter in to his body. Zama. That's amazing. That's some of the original paintings. You can still see it on the walls. Es muy caliente para mí aquí hoy. So this is the entrance to a cenote, and we were swimming in a cenote the other day and going to swim in one again because they're all underground caves underneath all the ground here. You can actually go and swim in them and see turtles and fish and it's refreshing and, and they supply the fresh water for the Mayan people. They do believe this is the entrance to the underworld.